My name's Kyle Johnson. I'm a uh, photographer based out of uh, Brooklyn, New York. Currently, I am in Bethel, Vermont. I've only been based in New York for the last seven months, so it's been kind of a crazy time to be going through this. Almost every 30 or 40 minutes, I would hear sirens. So it was, it was intense. And I mean, honestly, after like a month and a half, like more or less not leaving my apartment, I was going kind of crazy. My friends, Andrew and Rita, who have a, primarily a flower farm in Vermont, they basically said they were willing to have me come help out on the farm a little bit and get out of what seemed like a pretty rough situation. I've been a full-time freelance photographer for over 10 years. Mostly uh, editorial work, so a lot of portraits and a lot of uh, outdoor and travel related work. I've been helping out with like anything that they need, so weeding, um, right now we're doing a lot of transplanting from the greenhouse out into the real um, farm beds, so that's transplanting has been a big task. Um, composting and digging um, trenches for potatoes and um, you know just making small little little things around the house. It's been nice to, I mean it sounds kind of cheesy, but it's nice to have more of a sense of purpose I feel like when I wasn't shooting anything for over a month and it started to feel kind of sad and like you know like what am I even doing so having more of a set schedule is nice for the brain I think. I took a few photos for the first time I wasn't really taking any photos at home and I wasn't out documenting kind of the weird empty New York it just didn't really seem like something I wanted to shoot and then since being out here, I've been shooting hundreds of photos, like, you know, everything from the animals to, like, random little details and, like, scenes that just kind of unfold on a walk or documenting some of the work on the farm and the flowers. On one end, I feel really lucky, but on another end, I feel a little bit like I want to get back and, like, you know, be around the city that I, you know, I, I definitely have seen the New Yorker, like, you know, thing you always hear about that the community really has each other's back and really, you know, it goes through hard things in a way that I think no other city does because it's so dense that I think there is something kind of special about that, like hearing everyone cheering at seven o'clock and, you know, all the little things that I would look forward to while I was there during this that you can't deny that it's like a pretty special city even though it's taken this really hard. I know I can't really just stay out here forever, so trying to enjoy the time outside while I have it and enjoy the chance to, uh, you know, do more physical labor and be spend time around friends and people that I love. Just think about what really is important right now and, you know, what I want to do in the future and, you know, using the time to try to, like, make the most of it.